Hoeke Bamwe Kakai Funua. We're going to look at the arts now and Inasi. First Fruits is the title of an exhibition at the Mangere Arts Centre. It opened on the 4th of uh, this month and it will uh, run until the 18th of March. Benjamin Work is uh, joining us uh, via telephone to talk to us a bit more about this uh, exhibition. Si oto ofa, maaloi lele, Benjamin. Si oto ofa, John. Thank you for having me on your programme. Always a pleasure, my brother, and uh, great to have you on uh, our Polo Kalama to talk about this exhibition. Now, Inasi, there's, uh, I guess, a variation of uh, um, uh, meaning to it, but tell us about th- what this exhibition's about. Well, this exhibition is based on the Inasi Festival that happened annually between June and July oh, yeah. in Tongatapu. It's around the same time as uh, Matariki, or as we say in Tonga, Mataliki, and it basically involves the offerings of the Fuatapu, which was the sacred first fruits of the land that went to Hikoleo, who lived in Pulotu, but she was represented on earth by the Tuitonga. So the best crops and the talents from not only Tonga, but across Tonga's Moana empire that stretched far and wide, even to Samoa, um, was brought to La Baja Moa oh, yeah. Tongatapu. Um, but it wasn't just food, it was a selection of the best favour. Funga, Nimamea, uh, Hiva, Haka, Puhu, Sika, and Pangatua, and even uh, especially Inukawa. <laughs> a, big, a, a mix of everything, eh? Yes. It, it reminds me of the King's birthday celebrations today with the Royal Agricultural Festival yes. and other celebrations that take place. And we bring our very best to show showcase. That's right, because we're very mafana. Now, tell me about how this idea came about, because it's yourself and a couple of other uh, um, uh, Tongan artists, eh? Oh, yeah. Um, so, uh, the artists involved is Loa Toitu, uh, myself, Eric Toakai, um, Rizvan Tuitahi, Saya Tuitahi, Sam Tuitahi, uh, Taria Koloa Matangi, and Taukei Hard. Um, so, we uh, call ourselves Kava Book. Uh, Club Aotearoa, oh, and um, that that was birthed in 2020 during the pandemic, and uh, it was birthed out of a desire of uh, uh, Gautama that wanted to reconnect to our whanua, to our stories, and with like-minded people. So the group of artists, academics, practitioners uh, living in Tamaki Makoto, we got together at um, Taria Kolomatangi's Tata Tau studio in Central Auckland, and oh, we yeah. started meet, meeting around the Ta'anoa bowl and having good Ta'anoa and sharing of ideas. Uh, the thing I really enjoyed about this group is there's no gatekeeping. So there's no, um, you know, hierarchy that you can't know this and you can't share this, but there's a, a common common ground, there's a common space. Go oh, yeah, go oh, yeah. And, and tell me about uh, your journey. Uh, and uh, you mentioned that about connecting uh, to your Tongan roots and how has this help, uh, uh, helped you to uh, connect uh, with your uh, uh, Tongan connection? I think uh, as a young man, I was looking for uh, uh, mentors or, you know, pe- elders to guide me in that. And uh, unfortunately, I didn't have that experience. So for me, um, this is a great space to learn, but also to share everything that I've learned. Because we, we're seeing a, a, a really a big rise in indigenous people across the world in the diaspora, those that are away from their homeland, the, the desire to reconnect to who they are. And um, this is a safe space for us, um, those that feel maybe they don't know how to be in a traditional space, but there is no judgment, um, there's only encouragement, and um, just a lot of uh, inukawa and talanoa. <laughs> Popo, and that's where all the good stories are around the Tanoa Bowl. Eh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, well, who would you like to come and see the exhibition? Because it's opened already until the 18th of uh, next month. But who would you like to invite uh, uh, now that uh, others are, are tuning in right now? Uh, who would you like to come and uh, take part or take away from this Inasi exhibition? Uh, the exhibition is open to everyone. Um, our desire is that everyone would engage in uh, song and culture and have a maybe a greater understanding but primarily you know it's our own people it's those that are uh, desiring to connect to understand the stories engage with who they are um, so we have we, it's open to anyone 
uh, during the week. But this coming Saturday at 1 p.m., we have a, a Inukawa Talanoa session. Um, and we have a special friend, a special guest, uh, Hufanga, Professor Okusitono wow. Mahina. Wow. He's joining us, mm. um, a very valuable knowledge holder. Absolutely. Um, so that's open to anyone. And then on, on Friday the 10th at 1 p.m., we are having Tata Tao take place in the gallery. Wow. So, um, Sione, this is your time to come and <laughs> get your uh, Tata Tao. <laughs> I'll be your stretcher. <laughs> I've always wanted to get a tata tao, but maybe in private. Uh, <laughs> it sounds like it's going to be part of the exhibition. But uh, what what an ex, uh, what an uh, excellent idea to also showcase that uh, art form of he uh, the, the Maori people as well as you know uh, Tahitians, uh, uh, Hawaiians uh, are, are big on uh, you know showcasing their tata tao. But I know that uh, uh, Mr. Kolomatangi uh, Terry has has been part of the movement. Okay, the whakafoki mai tau. So that's going to be on show as well? Right. Oh, yeah. Um, so uh, Terry Taria, he has um, a carving there. Uh, it was one of his works, but he will also be um, performing or practicing Tata Tao in the gallery. Maria Alpito. And just before we say goodbye, just give us uh, um, uh, just a little uh, uh, overview of some of the other uh, different uh, artworks uh, uh, that's part of this multidisciplinary exhibition. Yes, uh, we have some carvings. Um, there's also some paintings um, from a few of the artists, but also uh, TK has made some prints and um, there's some beautiful fung fung there. Um, but there's also uh, audio that you can listen to um, oh, yeah. some of the fung fung sounds and beats that um, Saya Tuitahi's made. There's spoken word by Eric Stokai and then, um, uh, also another uh, kind of rap performance spoken word by uh, Rizvan, who's uh, super talented. Um, but yeah, overall, uh, it's a good variety. And um, yeah, we just like everyone to come and engage with the work and um, yeah, respond how they, how they want to. Congratulations, uh, Benjamin. Pe a oato e fagamalo mo e tala monu ki he toenga a e kaua artisi o ngau kaua tu ki he polo kalama koena i he mangere uh, art centre. Fagamalo atu malo a bit of for uh, letting us know about it. And uh, as you've heard, uh, uh, that was a taste of what's on uh, offer uh, at the mangere art centre. I na koe i mangere. Uh, koe fari ari. We're showcasing our Tongan roots and uh, what a special way to showcase, but from our very own Tongan artists and their own experiences. Talamonua tu kia koe pensimani, malo a pito si kama he taupolo kalama. Malo a pito, John, tu i o tahuhu. O falahia tu toko ua, eh? Mao hai fiafnele. Take care. Take care. Ho eki pamoe kakai fonoa na moto